Hi Trent. Hey, we're back. <laughs> we're actually twinning this year. I know. Right. You guys, we have found our Colorado Joneses and our short round. So we'll go, we'll go through. And if you guys, they've all been in my videos before. But if you want to introduce yourself, Seth Broner. I've uh, been a huge Indiana Jones fan pretty much my entire life. Known at the Southern Comic Cons for my Indy, but this is a different level. And then this guy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Trent, doing Temple of Doom with Kirk and Alex. Doing Temple of Doom, Alex Haugen. Well, we have a nice squad of indies, and it's very loud. Hopefully, you can hear all this. Nice. All right, we came outside because it's a little bit cooler and a little bit quieter to do a gear breakdown. So we'll start off with Alex. Take it away. Hey guys, Alex. Um, just going to do a quick gear breakdown. Um, I've got a Cillian Jones uh, Temple of Doom jacket that I acquired secondhand from uh, Andrea, uh, and I love it. Perfect fit on me. It's a great buy from him. I also love Cillian Jones jacket. This is probably my fourth Cillian Jones. Um, great material, great build, great weathering. Um, Hat is uh, my uh, vintage that I got from the Adventurous Summit um, in Germany a couple years ago. Um, has a little Adventurous Summit logo on the inside. Kind of, kind of a nice little uh, remembrance piece from that. And the whip I'm carrying with today is a Trinity Whip Company uh, whip from Blake, uh, Temple of Doom style. Okay, and whiskey. Awesome. Well, thank you, Alex. All right, so uh, Seth Gruner here. Um, I've got a uh, redone, uh, redone hoof hood that was done pretty much by everyone. I've got my uh, Wested Leather. Um, this is actually my third Wested, but I think this is my favorite. It fits the best out of all of them. And believe it or not, guys, everything else except for the whip, I was able to find a good one. So if you're shopping for some stuff, Goodwill, Arc, all that kind of stuff, those are gonna be your best friend. Everything else except for the jack, uh, everything except for the jacket, the hat, and the whip found a good one. So, you'd be surprised what you can find there, guys. Have fun. So I'm doing Temple of Doom today, and it's quickly becoming one of my favorites of all time. I love the look here at the con. So for the hat, you've seen it before, it's my Steel and Jones uh, Superior Crusader model. I dropped the back to give it some taper, and now it's a Temple of Doom. Probably one of my favorite hats that doesn't have a razor. And let's see, jacket is a super old Wested that was weathered by the previous owner. It's got like no seams left on it. I'll just do a 360 because the weather is fun. Really good stuff. It also has a polyester liner. It's way up here for some reason. Interesting. Uh, back strap is by Kyle Nibbling. It's got the aged crackly look to it. Bag is um, presumably one of the old, you know, World War II gas masks, and it's uh, accurate to the bridge scene on Temple of Doom because it has the three vent holes. Super faded, but I really like the authentic weathering. Hand wrap is repurposed from my costume base shirt. I kind of doubled up and had it as like a face dauber because I perspirate more than I even care to mention. Shirt is what price boring? Kirk himself weathered it, and I, I really like the grittiness, and it just it matches the aura of what this film is about. Uh, gun rig is by Brian Levon. Really, really good leather. Holster is a genuine 1918 Webley. Uh, whip holder is Chris and Corral, or if you're Joey Peter Green, Chris and Coral. Uh, whip is a refurbished Del Carpio. Probably one of the cooler whips they have. Um, so the previous owner's dog ate the thong entirely. And then at one point, Blake Bruning got his hands on it, redid some things, but I felt like it needed just one more thing, so off it went to Casey Tyler, and he redid the whole thing. That's why it has like a really weird two-tone effect, and he also redid the heel and the wrist loop to my liking. Very nice job. I also went ahead and darkened those. Uh, what belts? Amazon, obviously, is always Amazon. What Price Glory 2019 uh, trousers, and finishing off with my 
403 albums. I believe that is everything. So, no spreads here. I'm also doing Temple of Doom. I love that Alex, Trent, and I all do Temple of Doom because everyone always does Raiders. Um, pretty much all of this is stuff you've seen before. Um, we have my Advantage Minecart style uh, Temple of Doom hat. Steel and Jones Temple of Doom jacket. What Price Glory shirt. Trousers or Westeds. And then Alden 405s for the boots. One thing I haven't really showcased in any of my videos is my weapons belt. So I have a Spade Archer leather holster. I love this holster so much. My whip holder is from Todd's Costumes. It's the Velcro one. It's my preferred if I'm walking around a lot, like at a con. The whip is my uh, typical Joe Strain 8-foot Raiders, which is going on 10 plus years old now. And lastly, this is my most recent acquisition, but one of my favorites, Devils in the Details, um, is a Temple of Doom uh, belt by Kyle Nibling, and he did a fantastic job on that. So that is my gear today. Thanks for watching. Fortune and glory. Monster Wayne, do you need help with your magnet face? <laughs> with your magnet face? <laughs>